today we are going hygiene shopping like big period hey, can you focus on what's up dolls welcome back to my channel it is your girl doll figure and today she is back with another video you guys i've been holding out you guys for this video specifically so today i am super excited because i have a lot to get first stop is target and we're about to go in here and get it in so if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and join the dog gang for all the vibes baby we're about to go ahead and get it in so let's go these native body wash fragrances and the only one that has fully got my attention is this grapefruit and bergamot now this smells really good this smells really damn good this is the only one i like now all the other natives i'm sorry for all the native girl lovers it's trash like i i don't see what you guys are seeing but this one grapefruit and bergamot really good i just wanted to smell it i'm not gonna get it though okay dolls so you guys already know that the saint ives is my go-to and it's the pink lemon and mandarin orange so i'm definitely gonna stock up on this okay you guys so i need a little help because i'm kind of stuck this is literally my favorite go-to for a coffee scent and then this also exfoliates you super good and then this one i feel like is really good but it doesn't give the same effect that this would because it's not an exfoliant but what i was thinking was pairing it with this dove brown sugar and coconut butter exfoliating body polish so i don't know and i'm not walking out of here with both decisions let me tell you what's really the go this crushed macadamia and rice milk this smells so good you guys and yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and get one of each but this this is the truth like i haven't even tried it yet but this scent yeah i'm about to be smelling like a whole fucking snack so I think I'm gonna try these. Normally I get these and I mean, I don't really care for them that much because it's like shaped with this like lubricated shea butter. And yeah, I don't like how like if you leave it in the shower, it gets kind of like gooey. So I think I'm gonna stick with this y'all. This is supposed to be a Shea Butter 24 Moisture Shave Cream Vanilla Bliss, but it really doesn't have that vanilla scent to it, so I'm gonna pass. This one is lavender. This smell like Nair, I'm cool. So normally I go with Dove deodorant, but I wanna kinda budget today. I am gonna go with some degree and i normally use it's between degree and dub i switch in between deodorant so This will be my first time trying the Thera Breath, and I really am kind of like stuck in between these three. So the first one is the Blue Bottle. It's Invigorating Icy Mint. Seen the reviews, the reviews said that this one is really good on TikTok, but then a lot of people are saying the pink one, which is Sparkle Mint, is like the holy grail. So I don't know, you guys, I really don't know. And then of course, I like green too. So I just wanna get it because mild mint, I like minty things and I think like the mild mint would be good for me, but I don't know. I am really thinking about going with the Sparkle Mint though. 
yeah. Okay, so even though I just got off of my menstrual, I still am gonna restock on my um, like period products. So I love the Playtex Sport. I have been wearing Playtex Sport since I've been in high school and I have not switched. Normally they have um, like this one. This one is a 48 count. It has regular um, and super, but they don't have the super and super plus so i'm just gonna go ahead and stick with the 36 count which is super and for my panty liners i normally go with the honey pot panty liners but they don't have the purple pack which is the lavender one um the lavender one with the hint of mint is really good like i like i know a lot of people don't like the minty like feeling or sensation i do but they don't have it and i think i still have maybe like 10 left so i'll just use that until i run out so i might just go ahead and stick with that until i come across the purple pack because here they don't have it so these aren't the panty liners, but these are the actual pads, but I just still wanted to show you guys what I'm talking about. Yeah, so I normally go with this kind, the mint lavender, and it's really, really good, you guys. It's a little bit cheaper than this one since it's panty liners. So this is going to be my first time trying the Ollie gummy vitamins and this one is for beauty which includes healthy hair skin and nails biotin keratin vitamin c and e and it comes with 60 of them so i'm excited to try this stuck right now so I'm in the facial cleanser aisle and I normally go with CeraVe um, I used to use um, Cetaphil no longer I'm a CeraVe girl and they have this new acne control cleanser but look at the size of it you guys but this is what I've been needing it reduces blackheads and helps prevent new breakouts improves the look of pores and maintains a protective skin barrier okay but this is $13 then they have the value size of just the regular foaming facial cleanser, which cleanses and removes oil without disrupting a protective skin barrier. This size versus this size, okay? This is $16. So this bottle is $14. And then this is the mama size, okay? This is still bigger than this one. So I just don't know which one to choose from. Okay, so I'm no longer gonna go with the brown sugar and coconut butter exfoliant, which is in the Dove one, because I honestly, I feel like the macadamia rice water one will go really good with my body wash. And it honestly is, it smells better than that one. But you guys, the watermelon tree hut scrub, I'm getting this because this is gonna go so good with my pink mandarin one that I showed you guys from St. Ives, so yeah. Right, dolls we have made it back to the house and it is time to do the haul now when i tell y'all she went shopping okay she went shopping period like y'all and this is not even i still got bags over there okay like when i say i'm gonna give y'all that haul i meant that like we was going hygiene shopping for real for real I think I want to start with my good old grill Target. So let's go ahead and get into the Target items because, yeah, I kind of got a lot of stuff. And, you know, I know all my girlies, we we some Target girls for the most part. You know what I'm saying? So let's get into that. 
first category is body care okay body care so i got these two loofahs and i already have two loofahs in my shower but it's coming up on about three weeks and it's time to you know rotate that out throw it in the trash and get some new ones so normally i get two loofahs one for my body and then one for like you know my cookie and then one for the tushy so yeah um i don't like to use the same loofah that i'm using on the cookie and the tushy on the body so i feel like that's really good hygiene care me personally i would rather have two loofahs one for the cookie and the tushy and then another one for my body. Um, it's just like that thing where with me, I'm not gonna wash my face with the same towel I wash my ass with. You get me? Like, so y'all could look at it like that. You always wanna have, well, for me, I have a separate towel that I use for my face only, and then I have a separate towel to wash my body. I'm not gonna mix the two. You know, it just, you don't do that. <laughs> you just, you just don't do that, that's nasty. So I got my loofahs and with loofahs, of course, you know, I needed some body wash. So I read up on the body wash, St. Ives, St. Ives, like in St. Ives, I purchased the pink lemon and mandarin orange, which is the pink bottle. And then I also got the oatmeal and shea butter. Now the oatmeal and shea butter, I have used this quite a few times, but my favorite out of both of these is the lemon mandarin. Um, this one is definitely like a real nice silky body wash. It feels so good on your skin. Like it leaves you just feeling so soft and smelling good. And then this, it still gives that silky vibe, but it also gives you those exfoliating beads in there to where like you finna get real clean. So yeah, if you guys have not known about these body washes i'm gonna need y'all to get on it like definitely try them out they do have different ones too they have a whole line full of body washes not just these two so i really encourage y'all to try it but these are my two favorite ones and i'm gonna touch on something one of the girlies is talking about them native body washes and let me tell you something majority of them shit stank okay there was only one and i showed y'all earlier it was like a bergamot pomegranate one now that that smelled really, really good. But all the other ones, mm -mm, it was not giving. The next thing I got to pair with the St. Ives body wash, y'all, is this Tree Hut Watermelon Shea Sugar Scrub. It smells really good. And you know, I've had different Tree Hut scrubs, but I've never seen the watermelon one. This is so crazy. And this smells really good. So this is gonna be my new combo in the shower with that St. Ives. It's so cute how they, oh, it's so cute how they gave it that watermelon vibe with the little black seeds. You guys, this smells so good. So I also purchased me a scrub in Dove brand. This one is the crushed macadamia and rice milk. And you guys, this smells really good. It's something different. I've never smelled anything like this. Yeah, this is really different. Literally, when I scrub with this and wash with that shea butter oatmeal body wash, and then I put on my bum bum cream and my um, cocoa butter, I'm gonna smell like a whole little snack. Like, I'm gonna smell so yummy. So yeah, moving on. So I purchased me um, four count triple blade in the up and up brand. This is also compared to Bic. This one has a lavender scented handle. So yeah, these are pretty good. The next category we are stepping into is skincare. And the first item for skincare is my CeraVe Acne Control Cleanser, which I have been waiting on because this targets blackheads, which is something i get i get a lot of whiteheads honestly not blackheads for real but i get whiteheads either way this is something i've been needing this one it controls acne it prevents new breakouts and it improves the look of your pores and maintains the protective skin barrier so i am super excited to finally try this because i have been waiting for one of these to drop. This year, my goal is to really focus on just self-care overall, but really target my skincare routine because I never really had a set skincare routine and products that I use to get my face to where I want it to be. This year, I'm not playing with myself and I honestly have been doing research, you know, asking around like, hey, what do you feel would be best for my type of skin type? I'm figuring it out. So, 
um, skincare can really be expensive. So I'm really just right now trying to find what works for me and stay within budget and then move up to the more advanced products. So that's why I'm using CeraVe. CeraVe ain't cheap but it's cheap enough like it's it's affordable because i've seen some crazy outlandish prices for the the stuff that a lot of the girlies is using for their face i ain't got to that point yet however CeraVe works for me of course with a face wash you know i feel that you're always going to need a moisturizer and i personally have always struggled with finding a good moisturizer for my face i was on tiktok and i did some research and a lot of the tiktoks for black women i seen the um the Pond's facial moisturizer. And I was just like, let me see what that's about. And I was surprised because I thought this was gonna be expensive. Girl, I seen it in Target and I was just like, oh, this is $6. So I got me the Pond's Dry Skin Cream Facial Moisturizer. It says it's rich in hydration. And I've never used this, but I'm definitely about to see what the hype is about. I'm excited to see what type of moisture it brings to me. So another thing I got from Target is these Hero Mighty Patches. I know a lot of you guys have seen these. Um, you guys see like people walking around with the little stars on their face or like the little clear patches. Yeah, so this is that. And I got me a pack. Um, this will be my first time trying it. Kind of excited because I'm just, girl, I'd be tired of getting these little pimples and blemishes and not really being able to do nothing about it and just waiting for them to fade. So I feel like this might do me some good. It says it absorbs pimple gunk, it shields skin for faster recovery, and it shows results within six to eight hours of applying the patch to your skin. So this pack comes with six originals for nighttime and then six invisible for daytime. So that's cool. I also purchased me this sponge from e.l.f. This is the concealer sponge. And I already have this, but it has been long overdue. I don't care how many times I've cleansed it. I needed a new one. Um, this is very important as well for your skincare because you don't want to have like dirty brushes or keep sponges for too long because I feel like that's why at times i possibly could be getting these pimples and sometimes breaking out because you know i'm using these sponges and brushes over and over again and they do hold bacteria too so yeah got this um facial sponge for my concealer hey dolls so i'm gonna go ahead and finish off the video sitting down on my bed because your girl feet hurt and i've been on my feet all day and i'm getting tired moving along I purchased the Up and Up Premium Cotton Rounds and these come in a hundred counts. Yeah, I use these to remove makeup. Um, sometimes I apply alcohol and like, you know, clean my ears sometimes behind my ears, but overall these are really good. Of course, with the makeup wipes, I had to go ahead and grab me some more Q-tips. Um, these are the Cotton Swab Paper. These is Q-tips, okay? They got all this extra stuff q-tips okay um 500 count yeah so moving along to the next category we have reached the oral health we are in oral hygiene now you guys oral care so the first thing i purchased is another toothbrush it is in the medium texture yeah i don't use soft toothbrushes it just does not work out for me i need me a medium toothbrush and you guys i did get two of these but um i opened the other one because i needed to brush my teeth and i had got me a pink one and then of course to go along with the toothbrushes you need your toothbrush holders and i got them in pink and green i seen on tiktok that everybody has been using this therabreath mouthwash so i was just like let me see what the vibes are giving so yes i picked me up some therabreath mouthwash everybody was saying that um the pink bottle which is the sparkle mint is really good this one helps fight cavities for 24 hours it strengthens teeth enamel and freshens breath this also helps rebuild weakened tooth enamel and reverse early tooth decay this has no alcohol, works instantly, non-burning, it says. So yeah, um, I'm super excited to try this because I've been seeing this, like I said, all over TikTok. And you know, TikTok, it be leading the way sometimes. Okay, so we are gonna step outside of the oral health department and put it to a pause because right now I'm just trying to focus on the items that I purchased from Target. And then we are gonna go ahead and do a little wraparound. I think I'll do a wraparound. We'll wrap around. <laughs> so go ahead and get back into the dental care um, once I get to the other stuff that I got outside of Target, if you catch me. 
I also purchased two of the twin pack for degree deodorant. I got them in the sheer powder scent. So yeah, I definitely need a deodorant. Even though I'm not due yet for my menstrual to start, I still went out and got me the Playtex Sports tampons just so I can be ahead of the game because yeah, no matter what, that baby is coming. Okay, and this is the 36 pack in Super. You always need a good set of wipes, especially when you're on your period. At least for me, I like to keep wipes. I like to keep wipes all the time, but especially when I'm on my period. And this time I got the fresh cucumber wipes. And when I don't get the cucumber wipes, I get the non-scented wipes because I don't do all that fragrance stuff down in my tushy and my coochie. <laughs> all right, so we are down to the last two items and these two items really didn't have a category I could place them in. So that's why I saved them for last. So I have the Miel Mint and Rosemary Hair Strengthening Scalp Oil. Yeah, I'm sure y'all know that this has been all over TikTok. It blew up really quick and real bad. I got me a bottle of my own. My sister definitely used this on my hair a couple of times when she washed my hair and it does work really good. So I had to get me my own bottle. And the last item, I wanted to really try some vitamins. I was just like, you know, I really need to start getting my vitamins in. So I got me the Ollie Beauty vitamins in the gummy form. This is for healthy hair, skin, and nails. So now we are going to move on to Dollar Tree, you guys. So from Dollar Tree, I was able to find my exfoliating gloves. Yeah, because at Target, they was playing with them prices. So I got this for $1.25. And also, I got this from Dollar Tree. And this is a cleansing dual facial brush and it has like the soft bristle brush right here and then the back side is like the the hard exfoliating part i don't really know what to call it i also grabbed me some bobby pins you guys and then some hair scrunchies and y'all i was super surprised so i grabbed me my floss because i could not find the floss that i normally use which is my close-up colgate floss they didn't have it in target so i went to dollar tree and they had it but you guys, they also had these. These are called Grin and they sell these at Target. So when I came across these in Dollar Tree, I was super surprised and they ran for $125. I don't know how much they ran for in Target, but I'm pretty sure they were more than $125. I also got me some toothpaste, you guys. And just like my deodorant, how I flip flop between Dove in degree i flip flop in between my toothpaste i use the crest 3d and this is the stain eraser in the mint splash flavor and then i also use colgate optic white from time to time this is also a stain fighting toothpaste as well and then i also picked me up <laughs> some um gum so that is everything that i got from the Dollar Tree and we are going to end it with the items that I got from Marshall's. So let's go ahead and get into that. So the first item I purchased from Marshall's was the exfoliating spa towels. Finally got my hands on these. These were $5.99 and it comes with the pink and brown one. So the pink one it says is the medium grade for more gentler maintenance and daily use. And then the brown one is for extra rough grade. Helps to vigorously exfoliate. So I probably will not be using the brown one because it is a little bit more harder in texture. The pink one is more my speed. So even though I got that brush from Dollar Tree, I also got me called Smooth and Sheen Facial Exfoliating Duo. And it comes in a two pack. So more facial brushes to add to the collection. Next item I got was some makeup remover wipes and these are the Micellar Water Makeup Remover Wipes. And I feel like this will be really good. Um, I had the liquid bottle of Micellar Water, used all of that. And these makeup wipes run for $3.99. And this is really good. It comes with 60 sheets. So yeah, don't sleep on Marshalls y'all. All right, dolls, so that concludes everything that I purchased for this video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notification bell in the corner so that you'll be notified on when I will be posting more content. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe, 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 and join the doll gang. She is very tired. It is 1.45 in the morning. That is dedication. That's how y'all know I love y'all. For real, for real. 
and I just love creating content. So yeah, go ahead and thumbs up this video for that too, for the hard work and dedication. Cause yeah, y'all don't understand what we going into this shit. Okay. Like, Oh, she's tired, but y'all already know what time it is. As I always say dolls until next time, stay fabulous. And I will see you guys in my next video. I'm out. Hey, can you focus on me?